so now everyone now find final target is to create the like uh, uh, project i mean sorry profit center creation to create the profit center creation how to create the profit center and uh, this is my target everyone so what is the path and all so everyone concentrate here everyone now my target is i want to create profit center finally i want to create profit center <clears throat> so everyone concentrate here everyone very important everyone so create profit center what is the path this is the path everyone uh, sap menu accounting financial accounting general ledger master records then profit center individual processing and create this is the path everyone let it be let's go to that path and you people want to write something don't go to sprbo now you want to go in sap menu why because profit center is the master data profit center is the master data everyone on the sprbo screen on the sprbo screen we will do only configuration okay we will do only in the configuration in the spro screen in the sap easy access screen we will create master data we will post transactional data and we will generate the reports so report viewing accounting entry postings master data creation so this type of three things we will do in the sap easy access screen so on the spro screen just we will do the configuration that's it so profit center creation profit center is one of the master data profit center is one of the master data so how to create the mass profit center master data sap menu accounting then financial accounting then general ledger then master records profit center then individual processing and create everyone can you please note it down this create profit center ke51 and change profit center ke52 display profit center ke53 delete profit center ke54 display changes of profit center 6 kea please note it down everyone who is advait somebody joined name of advait who is he everyone somebody joined in advait uh venkat this is venkat uh let me change that thing i think my yeah, son you are venkat right yeah venkat bhai yeah advait nice name huh? who is he he is my son he joined the class so okay okay do, uh, do you saw that advait abushan uh, one vishal movie is there detective uh, yes yeah yeah good nice name actually please rename please change yeah i know note it down everyone note it down this t code and note it down full uh, create profit center change profit center display profit center delete profit center display changes of profit center please note it down everyone please go on mute done noted yes sir
done done everyone noted yes no okay sir <clears throat> so everyone concentrated everyone very important everyone to create the profit center to create the profit center so you just double click on ke51 ke51 is the t code this is the path everyone this is the path actually sap menu accounting financial accounting and general ledger master records profit center individual processing ke51 so you just double click on ke51 and uh, so guys before going to do this do one thing everyone before going to do this one second you can check this step everyone uh, which step activate controlling area first step activate controlling area i mean before going to creating the profit center once again you can check this one you are controlling area activation mode or not what is the t code okks one second uh, let's go to okks enter see somebody is not change so what is your controlling area everyone uh pm ca right i am believe pm ca yeah pm ca click on here okay <clears throat> so you can activate okay just like that now you try to create the profit center click on here ke51 and uh, set up here up to eight digit it may be numerical or it may be alphabets set up here up to eight digit example i am set up here pm100 I am set up here five digit. Maybe ten digit also it can be allowed. No problem. Up to ten digit. It may be numerical or it may be alphabets. Alpha numerical. Okay. <clears throat> so everyone, and the press enter. Press enter. Everyone enter. And uh, here you can take profit center name. Example uh, PM. steel sheet profit center profit center example pm steel sheet profit center and uh, responsible person mr madhu madhu is a responsible person then here everyone here here profit center group profit center group click on your browse here you need to take steel sheet example pm steel sheet profit center group pm steel sheet this one i am believe pm steel sheet profit center group this one okay pm st st something this one you need to take then here you need to assign the segment now here you can assign the segment click on your browse pm steel sheet segment and uh, here you can assign the segment so pm pm something is there na pm steel sheet this one everyone concentrate everyone and uh, so here set up here any name and from date and to date will pick automatically and name short name and long name and responsible person then profit center group then segment then press enter enter press enter then save then after save everyone don't forget to activate it's a very 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 important okay don't forget to activate here profit center has been created then one more one more profit center one more profit center <clears throat> go to pm 200 go to pm 200 then press enter i am repeating once again everyone i am repeating once again concentrate here my dear students concentrate here come to this path come to this path double click on this execute button ke52 sorry ke51 double click on ke51 
then enter up to 10 digits also it can be allowed but i am entering pm 200 and the press enter enter <coughs> so press enter then give it your name example pm steel rod segment sorry steel rod profit center profit center pm steel rod profit center now is a person responsible mr vishnu then group profit center group and the steel rod pm steel rod profit center group then segment segment you can assign the segment pm steel rod segment then press enter and click on your save save then activate here activate See here profit center pm 200 has been created like that one more we have four profit center you can create every month one more 300 press enter then the name example pm uh, opp cement profit center pm opp cement profit center then here responsible person example miss aparna then profit center groups so here you can take uh, opp profit center PMCT some PMCT OPP profit center. Then segment. Click on your browse. Segments you need to take OPP here. Yeah. So in case uh, OPP, yeah, this one. And press enter, then save and uh, you must activate the one more last one everyone i am creating last one after this i will show you one beautiful picture how it looks like and 400 press enter then here uh, pm ppp cement profit center pm ppp cement profit center and uh, person responsible, Mr. Ramu. And here, profit center group. And here, PPP, profit center. Then segment, it's a PPP cement. PPP cement. And press enter. Then click on your save. Click on your save and activate everyone <clears throat> everyone you can observe this everyone concentrated everyone what is our target here what is our target here what is our target here where is that ah this one everyone concentrate here so this is the profit everyone concentrate here everyone concentrate here so this is the profit centers we created under profit center groups under profit center group so this profit center group we are created under standard hierarchy so this standard hierarchy we are assigning into our controlling area this controlling area we are assigning into the company code it means so this company code indirectly will going to assign to my profit centers i will show you how it will be assigned indirectly my company code is assigned to my profit center i will show you this is the exactly picture everyone let it be let it be everyone concentrate here everyone go to this path everyone which path which path boleto go to this path i will show you uh, go to profit center groups everyone concentrate everyone concentrate here 
go to this part SPRO, financial accounting new, general ledger accounting new, master data, profit center, define standard hierarchy. You can go to this path, everyone. Let it be uh, SPRO. Everyone, concentrate here. Concentrate here, everyone. Very important. SPRO. SAP reference IMG. After creating the profit center, you can once again you can see this. And uh, select here financial accounting new. And general ledger accounting new. And master data. Profit center and here second one defined standard hierarchy. It's a group, everyone. Everyone concentrated, everyone. So, what happened here? So, this is the standard hierarchy, everyone. This is we assigned to our controlling area. So, under this standard hierarchy, we created two groups: one is PM steels and one is PM cement. Under PM steels, we have steel rod and steel sheet. And under cement, we have OPP cement and PPP cement. Under PPP cement, we have profit center, PM400. Under OPP, we have profit center, just now, PM300. And uh, this one, rod 200 and 100. This is the exactly flow. And example, this is the profit center. This profit center we created under profit center group. This profit center group we created under standard hierarchy. This hierarchy we created to controlling area. Controlling area we assign to company code. Hierarchy assigned to controlling area. Controlling area assigned to company codes. Got it everyone what I am telling? Yes, no, okay. Yes. Everyone, yes, sir. Uh, please practice. And uh, after practicing, let's check this screen and take the picture and post into the group. I will check you. So you are practicing correctly or not. I mean, after practicing, let's take this screenshot or take the picture and post in posting into our WhatsApp group. Everyone need to check. Okay, I want to know you people are practicing or not. Every day you can post into the screenshots also in the groups. You are practicing correct way or not, I need to verify. <clears throat> so click on your save and back. This is the one. Everyone. <clears throat> one more, one more everyone. Concentrate here everyone. And again come to same path. SAP menu, accounting, financial accounting, general ledger and master record profit center display processing uh, sorry individual processing next one display profit center display profit center so you just to double click on display profit center and uh, profit center example you can give it here any profit center pm 400 i am giving press enter press enter see here just display display so if you go to company code, if you go to company code, so you see here, PM100 and PM200, if you go to company code. And uh, somebody asked one question last time. I don't know, I forgot the name. Sir, how to assign, how to assign segment to company code? So everyone, so segment we are assigning into our profit center. So this profit center we are assigning into our company code. Indirectly we are assigning segment to company code. Who is he? Somebody asked. Do you understood now? Maybe somebody, I forgot name. The next one, change the profit center, change change the profit center okay so you just double click on change profit center and uh, give it your uh, 
any profit center name press enter so here you can change anything for example i am changing responsible person ramu to somu ramu to somu and press enter and save and uh, activate so why i ramu to somu means example everyone concentrate here everyone why i changed this means example i am pm group of company example i am pm group of company who is my employee example my employee is mr ram he is my employee now he is take care of all the profit center and now he is resigned in the company now he is resigned in this place mr somu has came mr somu has came so i want to replace right the name replace the name ramu to somu why because he is resigned the company he is going to another company in this place somu has came so i need to replace ramu to somu so this is my target i need to replace ramu to somu so how to replace this is the one everyone change change here you can change okay the next one next one display changes display changes what i mean in case if you change anything if, guys uh, last time somebody asked me question uh, i don't know who is he uh, sir if if i change anything am i check previous uh, information and present information in the master data yes answer is yes you can check what which field you changed what information you changed who changed what date they changed everything is accountable in the sap so you can't escape no 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 i did not change like that no you can't escape everything is accountable in the sap example here in my case in my case i changed responsible person name ramu to somu i changed my responsible person name ramu to somu okay so how to example uh how to check this i want to know somebody changed my system who changed what changed when changed that time you want to go this one display changes display changes so you just double click on uh, display changes and give it your profit center press enter and click on your all changes i'm repeating one second everyone i'm repeating one second so come to display changes 6 kea display changes and click on your pm 400 anything anyone and click on your all changes so here it will come so what is the old value old value is called mr ramu what is the new value new value is mr somu and which field they changed person responsible field what date they changed this date they change as per my system uh, today is the first day actually first of june okay today is the first day then uh, click on your display and uh, who changed changed by sap user your name will come in the real time changed by who what time they changed what changed everything will come everything is accountable okay this one even this one also you can take picture and post into the group i will verify what like this then one more one more is called delete i mean delete profit center everyone uh, note it down one note everyone note it down one note note it down one note as per the accounting 
concepts and conveniences otherwise as per the accounting rules and responsibilities as per the accounting rules as per the accounting rules deletion delete is not acceptable delete is not acceptable delete is not acceptable Yes, everyone. Any CA person, any accountant, is this is this uh, is this correct or wrong? Yes, sir. Yes, very good. So, in the accounting uh, prospect, you deletion is not acceptable. Actually, okay. Note it down. Continuation or next line. Next line. Note it down. In the place of delete. In the place of delete. we want to use block and unblock block and unblock or lock and unlock or lock and unlock lock and unlock okay can anyone please read the note everyone please remaining people please check it out yes sir yeah, as per as per the accounting rules and the responsibilities deletion or deleting any value is not acceptable in the place of delete we want to use block and unblock or lock and unlock lock and unlock everyone for example you created uh, one profit center so later you decided you want to you need you don't want to use specific profit center you create it, then otherwise you can use some time. Then later you decided, I don't want to use this profit center. Okay. So everyone, how to block and unblock? Or otherwise, how to lock and unlock? Very simple, everyone. Everyone, concentrate here, everyone. In case if you want to delete, deletion is not acceptable. In case if you want to delete, example, click on here, KE54. Then enter uh, this your uh, profit center and go to profit center and it, it's an hide mode actually. Let's see hide mode. It's not acceptable. Okay. And uh, everyone in case if you want to lock or unlock or block or unblock, how to use that here everyone concentrate here. Go to KE52, go to KE52, whatever profit center you don't want to use that profit center you want to lock or block whatever so ke52 then enter your profit center pm 300 anyone any profit center press enter then go to indicator go to indicator here lock indicator you just click on here this one lock then save save and activate and activate now it's a locked actually in the future by mistake if you use this profit center system cannot allow 
now it's unlocked actually do one thing everyone do one thing i used pm 300 right do one thing i'm going display changes i'm going display changes and i'm entering pm 300 press enter click on your all changes all changes example old which which field you changed which field you changed lock indicator and old value no lock x is not there the new value you locked x is there x x is not there and x there it's on a unlock now it's a lock new value which field lock indicators okay like this then how to unlock very simple again go to change and enter your respective profit center press enter then go to indicators then remove this tick mark then save yes and activate again you can go to display changes and press enter all changes see the first one first one is called okay first one is means last one in the i mean new new value now it's locked unlocked you do you understood everyone vice versa first i locked next is unlocked everyone are you following everyone yes sir vice versa first i locked later i unlocked okay and uh, now time to ask the doubts questions clarifications how to create the profit center how to post the accounting entries so this accounting sorry how to post the accounting entries during the accounting entry posting how to use this profit center then how to generate the reports that will come later so this profit center during the accounting entry posting how to use how to generate the reports that will come later now you people can ask the question how to create the profit center in case if you have any questions you can ask me sir in real time uh, will you use uh, lock option sir L yes answer is yes madam lock option you will use so uh, so venkat here Hmm. Yeah, so in the real time when we are doing this profit center updation so just we need to go to only one tab hmm. not other tabs we have other tabs like indicator yeah, not required tabs. that will pick automatically okay thank you and the yeah. second question is that when we are doing an implementation project hmm. we might have multiple number of profit center to create and changes hmm. and everything so do we have any other option or do we need to do step uh, that by will step come later that will come later we use lsmw the topic will come later mass update mass change that will come later no okay. yeah mass creation mass update that will come later okay, okay. thanks sir yeah arvind ji arvind ji sir yeah my doubt is uh, what is the difference between person responsible and user responsible in the profit center creation person and responsibility means actually what happened uh means user and person both are same actually for this person, we can give specific username actually. Either you can give SAP username or either you can enter person name. See, for every person, we can use one SAP username and password, na? that username. Okay. Yeah, yeah. That's, that's a, no, no other difference. No, no. Yeah. Yeah. So when you block any profit center here, uh, in the tree, will it be still appear or? Uh... Still appear, sir. Appear. But it can't allow during the accounting entry posting. Yeah, understood. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you, sir. Uh, yeah. sir yes, ma'am. Every profit center, we have to check with the approval. We have to take approval and you have to discuss with how many digits we have to fix it. Come, come, come again, sir. Come again. So every profit center creation, we have hmm. to check with the clients, and we have to discuss how many uh, digit we are uh, like we are. Ah, ah, ah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You can ask the suggestion to your client. Okay. Yeah. Answer is yes. Good. Okay. Thank you, sir. 
after creating the profit center do we have an choice of keeping it as a optional or it is a mandatory field ha uh, it's a screen layout screen layout level you want to set up this optional and uh, fields you are saying na which field is optional which field is required no that, no uh, Prof using of profit center while uh, making the accounting entry for example whatever uh, profit center you don't want to use that profit center you can make it as a lock whatever you profit center you want to use you will make it as a unlock maybe sometimes uh, accountants may maybe they will do mistakes by mistakely they will use so you can lock then system can't allow okay. yeah sir so if you lock the profit center How will you generate the reports, sir? Madam, lock means it won't allow during the accounting entry posting, madam. Reports will come later, madam. Why hurry, hurry? Reports, postings that will come later. Okay. If, sir, what will be the how? Sorry, fill out. What will the? Sorry, ma'am. What how will be? Account accounting entry posting. Accounting entry posting will come, Madam Ji. <laughs> Now you can ask me question to creation, accounting entry postings, and report generation. It will come. It will come. It will. Some more configuration is required. It will come, Madam. Please wait some more days. So sorry, right here again. So the profit center, whatever we are changing. So we are seeing one uh, from Ramu to Somu and everything. So how many changes we can see uh, last previous ones? Is there any limit, or we can see any number of changes? You can see n number of question. Oh, yes, yeah. n number. Of, yeah. 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 Yes, everyone. So the next topic is called document splitting. the document splitting is very 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 important how much this is important means 95% of interviews or 99% of interviews without document splitting question they never ended got my point so document splitting topic is very 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 important okay so everyone uh, tomorrow we have the class okay tomorrow we have the class so now i am sign out the class we will meet tomorrow we will discuss new topic in tomorrow why because maybe if i said now maybe you people will going to confuse so my request is you can complete up to profit center you can feel free to practice then you can take the picture and post into the our group then i can verify you are doing correctly or wrong the new topic we will start tomorrow tomorrow is saturday we have the class clear so far oh, yes sir yes sir yes sir all clear yes sir bye everyone